Hi, this is Patrick, and I am selling another vehicle at one of the most popular online auction sites, a 1994 Suzuki Sidekick JLX. 100% original, 90,000 original miles. I'll tell you exactly here in just a few minutes. So let's walk around the car, and let me tell you a little bit about a Suzuki Sidekick. You probably haven't seen these much on the road, but this was available in two-wheel drive, as well as the four-wheel drive JX and JLX models. This is the JLX, the top end. It's a multi-purpose vehicle that covers a wide spectrum of consumer needs. With an abundance of standard features, the four-door Sidekick provides a level of luxury equivalent to that of a much higher priced four-wheel drive sport, four-door sport utility vehicle. Amenities such as rear-wheel analog brake system, power steering, steel belted radi radials, power remote control, dual outside mirrors. Are you kidding me on the Sidekick? Split folding rear seat backs, an AM FM stereo, which has been replaced with a nice Kenwood aftermarket stereo. And the more luxurious model, which this one is, the JLX boasts additional features like power windows and door locks, chrome wheels, and a hard case spare tire cover that's original to the vehicle, as well as a rear window wiper and washer. Front McPherson struts with coil springs and stabilizer bar with a real trailing arm and suspension allow this four-door sidekick to provide a quiet, smooth ride on various types of terrain while economy ratings of 24 EPA. Are you kidding me? On a 1994, this is getting 24 miles to the gallon. So this is an incredible sidekick. The additional features of the JLX four-wheel drive include tilt steering column, power windows and doors, remote, remote dual lid release, rear window wiper washer, locking spare tire hard case, and the chrome wheels. So let's look at the inside of this car. It's again, it's 100% original. And I'm reading off of, I, I don't know a lot about Suzuki Sidekicks, but check this out. This is the brochure of a 1996 Suzuki Sidekick towing brochure. This is a 94. This came with the vehicle. You can zero in on that. I'm gonna tell you a little bit more because this can be a dinghy for your motorhome. It's already set up with the wiring to do so. We'll talk about that in a minute. But anyway, 100% original paint, 100% original interior, except for the Kenwood upgraded stereo. So let's check this out. Cloth interior. This was a well-kept truck. I bought it because it was too cool, too cute, and too fun not to, and drive this around for a while. And we're putting it on for auction. Someone's looking for a great tow dinghy for their motorhome or something to cruise around town. Maybe you want to lift it, throw some mud terrains on here, BFGs, Nitos, Goodyear Dura tracks. I'm not sure. But low range four wheel drive probably has some cool lift opportunities available for this. Um, really, the interior is almost perfect, but it is a 94 Suzuki Sidekick. A couple little, you know, what you saw just saw there on the driver's side door. Um, a little bit of wear by the uh, left and right window controls, but the interior is nearly perfect. The dash has no cracks. The plastic's all in excellent condition. The headliner is in excellent condition. I'm going to tell you those miles here in a second as we go to the back seat and around to the rear hatch here. Let's check that out. Here's that Suzuki Sidekick hard case tire cover only on the JLX 16 valve model. This is the top of the line Sidekick. Swing out, hatch. Lots of room for whatever you want to throw in here. And really, there's only a couple small dents here and there in the truck. They're mostly on the roof. Like People probably threw stuff up on the roof to haul little things and a couple specks of rust from a chip. There's no rust on the vehicle. I would consider it 99% rust-free. What is 100% rust-free these days? It's really hard to say that for a vehicle of this vintage. But as you can see, let's go down here to the bumper. There are a little couple stuffs on the bumper from, you know, where we're talking how many years of use now, 30 years of use almost. A little scrape here, but check out the entire side of this. Barely a dent. I mean, it's a small, not little wide. It's a very, not, not very wide car. So the chances of the door dings are slim, but the paint is in incredible condition. This was garage for a major portion of its life. Brand new tires. Chrome wheels are in excellent condition. There is, this is the only blemish on the entire interior. It's a little seam split on the uh, center cushion. Zero in on that, but look at the rest of the tweed cloth is nearly perfect. 
Um, and a pulser might be able to fix that, but that might be something you want to tend to once you buy this and start giving it your love. 20 miles. Let's get through it here. He's asking about miles. We're going to tell you about that in just a second. Check out the rest of this interior. Go around. I'm going to tell you exactly how many miles are on this. It's got 90,798 original miles, auto check, Carfax certified, against a Kenwood aftermarket system. Air conditioning blows super, super cold. It's unbelievable. It's got um, manual hubs in the front that you can lock in and lock out. Your four wheel drive controls are right here. The original four wheel drive transfer case diagram is here as well. Um, it's complete. I have all the books in this truck. If you call it a truck, maybe it's more of a car. Um, I'm gonna come around and open up the hood. This is a sidekick. And if you don't know, you got a pop the glove compartment, reach in here. There's a little lever to open up the hood. And we'll check out the motor of this rig. So it's a 16 valve four cylinder. I'm gonna tell you a little bit more about it as we look at the motor. But uh, this can be towed behind another vehicle. Uh, the method shown in this diagram, uh, you know, it goes through and tells you how to turn off the ignition or release the parking brake, set it to neutral, all that. It can be, it can easily be towed behind any vehicle. And down here below, right behind the license plate, we'll get down to in a second. There's your plug-in for your lights. So you can plug it in behind your tow vehicle. So this thing's pretty amazing. It's a, uh, it's can be used in a lot of configurations. It just had a lot of work done to it. It just passed the strictest emissions in, this, in the country here in the state of California. Passed with flying colors, but it's got new um, ignition wires, new um, distributor cap, brand new battery, brand new tires, new oil change. And we've been, I've been driving it a lot. It's just been way too much fun. Um, really cool car. So what we're gonna do, we're just gonna hop in it, go up the street, so you can, or um, you're gonna hear it start really quick. We're gonna hop in it. Take it for a little spin. Again, 90,798 miles. All the illumination on the on the dash works. Again, the AC blows ice, ice cold. So you check that out. There's your brights. Everything functions as it should. It's kind of late here. We're filming this in Santa Barbara, California. Just past sunset. It's uh, August. So you can hear the motor hum. Four-wheel drive works perfectly. Um, really, there's really no issues to speak of with this car. It just hasn't been used a ton lately. And um, I've been driving it around. Just took my son to school in it the other day. School just started. And get a lot of thumbs up in this little sidekick. And we're going to kind of go up the street here. And you can hear the motor rev. And we'll wrap up this video. Here we go. Well, thanks for watching. Good luck on this auction. And um, again, if you have any questions, let us know throughout the listing. Thanks.